Hey guys, what's up? Uh, today I figured I'd do an unboxing video for you guys. Uh, so I just got this from Amazon today. It's an exercise mat. I got this uh, because I wanted like a thicker mat or a better mat for my um, to use for my deadlifts. Before, if you saw in my other videos, I was just using towels and it doesn't work so well. So I figured I'd get a mat and see how that works. So let's open this guy up. Let's open this guy up. Hmm. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's a little shorter than I thought, but let's see how this uh, rolls out. I figured I would uh, fold this guy into th maybe threes or fold it in half, because originally I really wanted to get um, horse stall mats, but here in Japan they're very difficult to find. I couldn't really find any on Amazon, and I was looking up horse stall mats in the States and on YouTube videos of people, what people use on their gym floors, and apparently it's like three-fourths of an inch thick, thick. This guy, I think it's like a quarter of an inch thick, a quarter, yeah, one-fourth of an inch. So I figured I'd roll it up into threes and see how that works. So let's take a look. Alright, so this is what it looks like rolled out. I'm gonna put a barbell on there, just so you guys can see. It's it's long enough for the barbell. Only thing is, it's only a quarter of an inch thick, so I'm not sure if it's thick enough. I'm gonna try and fold it up into thirds to make it like three fourths of an inch thick and see how that goes. Alright, guys, so I folded up it, it up into thirds. This is what it looks like right now. It is a bit thin, but I think it should do. Uh, I tried some deadlifts on it earlier. It seems to cancel out the noise pretty well, but uh, only thing is the the mat. It's a little bit cushy, so I figured maybe I should cut it in half. That way I'll be standing on like wooden floor, and I won't st be standing on the cushion. But anyway, let uh, let me just show you what it looks like right now before I cut it. So yeah, that's what it sounds like right now. It seems pretty good, but uh, I still want to cut it in half and then uh, see what it's like from that. So anyway, I'll be right back. Alright, well, it seems pretty good. I'm pleased with the results. I didn't have to, I feel like I didn't have to put the, down the weight as low as I had to before. And I feel about right doing it. So, I did it up to, uh, I can't remember the math on this, but, uh, the bar. But, uh, the bar is like, uh, a little bit under 45 pounds. It's a bit of a strange bar, I'm not quite sure why, but, uh, yeah, a little under 45 pounds. And then on this, on each side I have, uh, I did it with like a 40, a 20 kilogram plate, 15 kilogram plate, and then a 5 kilogram plate. So yeah, oh, let's take a look at how the floor looks anyway. 
a bath. All right, let's put this guy back. All right, so that's look fine. Small indent on there, but floor looks good. That's what it looks like inside. And here's the other side in case you're wondering. Small indent. Still an indent there. At the bottom. Uh, can you see that? At the bottom it looks okay. And below, floor looks fine. Alright, so anyway, that's it for today's video, and I'll see you guys next time.